Welcome to the land of mathematics. Here I have negative 7y equals 28. And what I want to do is I want to find the value of y. I know it's so easy for you to just look at this and say negative sign times what number y um, equals 28. And you could probably do this in your head. But if you can please just follow these steps, all right, I'll try to make this really quick. If you just follow these steps, it's going to be incredible crucial for you to understand how we do these steps and then how we're going to do steps later on. So first of all, we just need to understand, we need to isolate the variable. By isolating the variable, we need to use inverse operations. Meaning I need to take a look, what is happening to my variable? Well, here it's being multiplied by a, pot, a negative 7. So I need to do the opposite of that, which would be to divide by a negative 7. Now I have to use my division property of equality to produce equivalent equations. So I'm going to divide by negative 7 on both sides. Negative 7 divided by negative 7 produces me a 1 times y, which equals 28 divided by negative 7, which equals negative 4. Now, by the multiplication property of 1, 1 times y is going to give me y equals negative 4. And there, you can see that I have now my value of y, which is equal to negative 4, which you might have been able to do in your head. Um, but you can see that these are equivalent equations with the same value. Thanks.